James A. Russell, a faculty member with the Department of National Security Affairs, teaches courses on Middle East security affairs, terrorism, and national security strategy. His research appears in a wide variety of media and scholarly outlets around the world. I am a uh, researcher that is interested in the study of the conduct of uh, combat operations by American military units. I'm uh, particularly interested in examining the capacities for uh, these units to learn, adapt, and innovate uh, while they're engaged with the enemy, which is to say while they are uh, 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 conducting combat operations. Uh, I've just completed a book uh, that will be coming out with Stanford University Press uh, in early 2011 that, uh, that uh, examines the conduct of counterinsurgency operations by a series of American Marine Corps and Army battalions conducting operations in Anbar and Nineveh provinces from 2005 through 2007. Uh, the argument in the book is that these units uh, innovated organically, as it were. Uh, they developed a series of new organizational uh, capacities, more or less uh, from the ground up, within the units, uh, that turned their organizations from ones trained and equipped for conventional military operations to units uh, that can conduct full-spectrum counterinsurgency operations ranging across the, the lethal uh, to non-lethal uh, range of different operations. Um, after the completion of this research, I have embarked on a second phase uh, which looks at American military operations uh, in Afghanistan. Uh, in January 2010, a former student of mine, Captain Robert Davis, a company commander with the 509th as part of the 4th uh, Brigade 25th Infantry Division invited me to come over to Afghanistan to look at the way in which his company was conducting operations uh, in Coast Province. So I spent several days with uh, Captain Davis's company uh, and then spent the rest of the month uh, with all of the different units in the 4th Brigade 25th Infantry, Infantry Division which, which is commanded by uh, Captain Michael Howard. Uh, the purpose of these visits was to interview the battalion commanders, the senior uh, officers in the battalions, to try and track the degree of organizational learning, adaptation, and innovation while the units uh, were conducting combat operations or engaged uh, with the enemy. My plan is to design a new course on, uh, on military innovation uh, that will be delivered here in the classroom uh, to our uh, students. Another output for this research will be uh, an examination of sort of the examples of good learning practices uh, while in combat, which can then be used by uh, our, our military uh, organizations to help incoming units prepare for the learning experience that they will uh, encounter when they arrive in theater. And so the, the idea uh, for this is, is, as I say, to get our uh, military leaders, junior military leaders, better prepared for uh, the adaptive uh, uh, and innovative uh, uh, sort of uh, uh, capacities that they are going to need uh, in combat and to get them ready to be able to make the, the changes that they need to conduct effective combat operations in a wide variety of different uh, environments.